Hey everyone, Tech Elementary here with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use the new image one on your iPhone or iPad. So let's get started. Now, you do need a compatible device for this. For the iPhone, you need any of the new iPhone 16 lineup or the iPhone 15 Pro or the 15 Pro Max. Now, for iPad, you need an iPad Pro with M1 chip or later, iPad Air with the M1 chip or later, iPad Mini with A. 17 pro or newer chip now once you have a compatible device you need to update your iphone ipad by going to settings general software update and make sure it's on 18.2 or newer now once you update to that or update version you'll be able to get this feature which is built into the notes app so go ahead and open up the notes app on your iphone or ipad and once you do that you're going to go ahead and tap over here to generate a new note now from there on let's click on over here for the icon and then create a sketch that we like to turn into a nicer image so i'll just draw something like a house here now this is very basic but of course if you have the apple pencil with the ipad it works really well and then once you're ready this is where the image one feature is available you'll see this icon here looks all half black and half uh, this other color once you have that you tap on that and you circle your image that you like To go ahead and generate and you can describe what that image looks like. So I'm just gonna say house Again, that's just a simple generic one, but the more descriptive you are with your sketch the better Image it will generate for you with the, your sketch. So I hit done here and it's taking my image that I sketch and then the word and it's generating multiple images as you can see here so if I like one, I'll just hit done here. So I click on that, and then I have this. So we have tap over here, and then I can see here, you can copy, share, save image, all of that, that will be available for you here. So let's go back here. Once I'm done, I'll hit done here. Go ahead and save it, go back. And I have this one that I selected right here on my notes. And you can do this for multiple generations if you have other ones that you want to generate. So let's go ahead and create maybe a sun here. Let's go ahead and do that. Click on that image. Select that. Just put sun and then hit done. And it's going to generate the sun, different sun images. So if you like any of them, you can just go ahead and select one. And I'm gonna go ahead and save here, go back, tap on that. And then you can see here you can move this around. Of course, you have to play with it to move the image around, select different ones. So if you have something, you'll need to remove this. But again, you get the idea here how to use the image one just like that. So that's how you do it. I hope this video is helpful. If so, please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. We'll see you guys next time.